Silence. À tous de vidéo, attention pour le décompte final. 10, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage Vulcan. Allumage UAP, décollage. de bord sont nominaux. La propulsion est nominale. In French Guiana, with a lot of fire. Nice shot of the birds on the port side as she took off. I don't know if you could see that. The DDO is saying that everything is going smoothly on board as Ariane begins her mission, the seventh for Ariane space. Tous les paramètres à bord sont normaux. Two new satellites for new services for new customers around the globe. À tous de DDO, attention pour le décompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage Vulcan. Allumage des deux EAP et décollage Ariane 237. Well, no doubt about it, night has turned to day, and the rumble in the Amazon jungle is that mighty Ariane 5 ECA. She's roaring out over Devil's Island. Take a la look at that picture correct, right la trajectoire now. Est nominale. One minute uh, into flight coming up, and the Ariane 5 has already broken the sound barrier here in Karu. The massive Jupiter facility that I'm at, we're going to start feeling it and hearing it. À tous des vidéos, attention pour les décomptes finales. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage Vulcan. Allumage UAP, décollage. Wait or not? Ariane 5 beginning her mission, lifting off beautifully from the ground here in French Guiana with a lot of fire. Beginning her mission, the fourth for Ariane space this year with her two new satellites for different regions for Latin America and for Asia. Making her way up through the clouds which have passed over us, giving us a great, great... DDO says everything is well on board. The two boosters are providing 99.0% of the thrust, propelling the launcher along her trajectory at an ever higher velocity. 775 tons at liftoff. That's the total mass. She's burning five tons of fuel every second, two and a half tons in each booster, and another 300 kilos in the core stage. À the tous de DDO, attention pour le décompte final. Final countdown. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage Vulcan. Allumage UAP, décollage. So right 
on schedule at 1839 local. Ariane 5 beginning her mission, lifting off perfectly and beautifully from the ground here in French Guiana with a lot of fire. Streaking through the clouds as the DDO says all is well on board, beginning her mission, the second for Ariane space this year, with two new telecom satellites for major regional operators. The two boosters are now providing 90, that's 9.0 percent of the thrust, propelling the launcher along her trajectory at an ever higher velocity. 775 tons is our mass at liftoff. She's burning five tons of fuel per second, 2.5 tons in each booster burning per second, and the core stage burning another 300 kilos every second. A tous de DDO, attention pour le décompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage de PC. Allumage de ZAP, décollage. Well, at 17.30 local time, and right on time, you saw Ariane 5 began her mission lifting off perfectly from the ground here in French Guiana with a lot of fire, beginning her mission the 11th and last this year, as the DDO says all is well on board, carrying two new telecommuni telecommunication satellites for major regional operators. Beautiful shots. À tous de DDO, attention pour le décompte final. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Top. Allumage Vulcan. Allumage des EAP, décollage. de propulsion sont tous nominaux. La trajectoire est nominale, tous les paramètres orbaux en bord sont en bord. Darting behind the clouds in and out, Ariane 5 beginning her mission, beautiful shots, lifting off at 10.06 local from the ground roaring off the ground here in French Guiana, beginning her mission, the ninth for Ariane Space this year, carrying the four new satellites in the Galileo constellation. Always impressive shots for the people here at the at Jupiter and on the uh, beaches and at the observation sites, leaving her trail of smoke and fire. Attention for the decompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage Vulcain. Allumage AP, décollage. Les paramètres à bord sont nominaux.
It's an e-ticket ride tonight as we rumble the Amazon jungle. The mighty Ariane 5 ECA roars into the sky over Karu. 49 seconds into the flight, Ariane 5 has already broken the sound barrier here in Karu. The massive Jupiter facility will be shaking momentarily as the rauncher roars out over Devil's Island, made famous by the movie Papillon. 1,300 tons of thrust breaking the Ariane 5 free from the Earth's gravity, and look at those pictures. 90% of that power coming from the two boosters, each one 31 meters tall, and burning 240 tons of solid propellant in two minutes. A tous de DDO, attention pour le décompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage du Vulcain. Allumage des EAP, décollage. Paramètres bord sont normaux. La trajectoire est nominale. What a sight. Blazing a trail across the equatorial skies, heading east over the Atlantic. A tous de DDO, attention pour le décompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, stop. Allumage Vulcain. Allumage des EAP, décollage. Les paramètres à bord sont nominaux. for the history books and in the memory of the late great Muhammad Ali the rumble in the Amazon jungle tonight is that mighty Aryan 5 ECA as she roars into the sky above Karu my 10th time that I've called a launch takes my breath away every time we're 57 seconds into the flight Aryan 5 breaking the sound barrier here in Karu A tous de DDO attention pour le décompte final 10 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage du Vulcan. Allumage des EAP, décollage. Les paramètres bord sont nominaux. La trajectoire est normale, les paramètres bord sont normaux.
And there she goes, lighting up the night sky over the equator. Here at the Guiana Space Center, we've broken the sound barrier. We're traveling supersonic, faster than the speed of sound, which is just over 1,200 kilometers an hour. Final countdown coming up. We'll cut away and let you watch and be back when Arian has cleared zero, the tower. Attention for the decompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, stop. Allumage Vulcan. Allumage EAP, décollage. Tous les, mat tous les paramètres à bord sont luminaux. Well, a beautiful liftoff as Ariane 5 began her mission rising into the night sky off of uh, French Guiana, a trail of fire against the night sky. Right on time, 2020 local, carrying her passenger until set 29E. So we are underway. The boosters are providing 92% of the thrust propelling the launcher along her trajectory at ever higher velocity, getting her away nominal. from the pull of the Earth. The DDO says all is well on board. And there is a lot to pull. Ariane's weight at liftoff is about 770 tons. Most of that is fuel, which she will rapidly start to shed because she's burning two tons of fuel every second. Ariane now following the flight program in the onboard computer, which gives all the commands, including stage separations, which we'll soon see. A tous de DDO, attention pour les décomptes finales. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage Vulcan. Allumage EAP, décollage. Well, we are underway. Did you watch? The arms the pull back as schedule, and did you count to seven? After those seven seconds, a slight wait, and then boom, away we go. You saw Ariane 5 begin her mission, rising off the ground here in French Guiana, leaving a trail of gold, and right on time, 1834 local with her two passengers, Arabsat 6B, also known as Bader 7, and GSAT 15. The boosters are providing 92% of the thrust right now, propelling the launcher along its trajectory at an ever higher velocity, getting her away from the pull of the Earth. And there is a lot to pull. Ariane's weight at liftoff, 775 tons, and most of that is fuel. She's burning two tons of fuel per second. She's now following the flight program in the onboard computer, which gives all the commands, including the separations. We'll soon begin to see those. We are in the first of four flight phases. The first three are powered. The last is not. We'll describe each in turn. Right now, the first flight phase, the Vulcan engine and the two boosters are burning. The boosters will burn their propellant in just under two and a half minutes. They're the first that will be jettisoned. You'll hear the DDO call out that milestone as he calls out right now. Everything is okay on board. A tous les DDO, attention pour le décompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage Vulcan. Allumage de ZAP, décollage.
become my trademark to call it the rumble in the Amazon jungle, and it really is as the mighty Aryan 5 ECA roars out toward Devil's Island. One of those bucket list events to have watching an Aryan 5 thunder into the sky from CSG. A minute into the launch, and the Aryan 5 has already broken the sound barrier here at Corvu. And this massive Jupiter facility literally shaking. We can feel it now. 1,300 tons of thrust breaking the Ariane 5, free from the bonds of Earth's gravity. 90% of that power coming from the two boosters, each one 31 meters tall, burning 240 tons of solid propellant in two minutes. That's better than two tons a second. When the boosters have done their job in a little less than a minute from right now, Ariane will be 70 kilometers into the sky. It'll be racing away from us at more than 1.6 kilometers a second, faster than a bullet. The information coming down to us at Gilat, the tracking station on a mountain just behind us here at the Jupiter facility. The next major event is the burnout and the jettison of those two solid rocket boosters. You're going to be able to see it live on the screen. It'll happen in about uh, 13 seconds from right now when those boosters have uh, completed uh, their job at uh, 2 minutes 20 seconds into the mission. So watch for that. And look at those pictures. In the clear skies above Karu, the boosters have uh, done their job. We don't need them anymore. À tous de DDO, attention pour le décompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage Vulcain. Allumage EAP, décollage. So the arms swung back as scheduled. You saw it there. We had ignition, and you saw Ariane 5 begin her mission, rising off the ground here in French Guiana. Fire right on time at little past the original launch window because we have the hold in the countdown. A tous de DDO, attention pour le décompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, unité, top allumage moteur Vulcain. Allumage confirmé. Top allumage AP, décollage. And there she goes, blazing her trail across the equatorial skies, uh, tucked behind a cloud there because uh, it was very beautiful skies earlier today and then uh, the clouds came in and uh, after the initial 12 seconds of vertical climb we rotated to the east and now we're heading out over the Atlantic Ocean. A tous de DDO, attention pour le décompte final. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Allumage moteur Vulcan. Allumage EAB. Décollage. paramètres à bord sont nominaux.
Fin de la manœuvre en roulis, la trajectoire est nominale. There's a new rumble in the Amazon jungle, and that's the mighty Amazon uh, Ari Ariane 5, rather, the ECA, as she roars out to where Devil's Island. I get so excited because it's my eighth time here. It still takes my breath away every time I see it. A minute into the flight, Ariane 5 has already broken the sound barrier here in Karu, and just uh, there we can feel it. The massive Jupiter facility literally shaking us. 1,300 tons of thrust break the Ariane 5 free from the bonds of gravity. I tell you, I, I get thrilled every time this happens. Attention for the decompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage Vulcan. Allumage AP, décollage. Propulsion est nominale. There she goes, hauling herself against the gravity of our planet. Est nominale. Everything's normal, he says. The propulsion is normal. We broke the sound barrier at 48 seconds after launch and went into Mach 1. And we're only now getting the sound here at the Jupiter Control Center as she flies over. I can feel the ground shaking. A tous de DDO, attention pour le décompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage Vulcan. Allumage de EAP. Tous les paramètres à bord sont normaux. That rumble echoing across the Amazon jungle is the mighty Ariane 5 as it roars into the skies above Karu. My seventh time I've had a chance to be here takes my breath away every time. 54 seconds into flight, Ariane 5 has already broken the sound barrier here in Karu. The massive Jupiter facility is going to start shaking in just a moment. We can begin hearing the sounds now. And there it is as the Ariane 5 roars out over Devil's Island and uh, into the sky above French Guiana. One incredible, powerful machine, 1,300 tons of thrust, breaking the Ariane 5 free from the bonds of Earth's gravity. 90% of that power right now as this building just rocks is coming from two boosters. Final countdown. 10, 9, 8, 7. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage Vulcan. Allumage UAP, décollage. Tous les paramètres à bord sont normaux.
fin de la manœuvre de basculement. So, did you watch the arms pull back right on time? We had ignition, you saw Ariane 5 begin her mission, rising off the ground here in French Guiana with a lot of fire, right on time. Carrying Intel Sat 30 and R Sat 1. The DDO is saying that all is well on board. We're underway. The boosters providing over 90, 90% of the thrust right now, propelling the launcher along its trajectory at an ever increasing velocity, getting her away from the pull of the Earth. And there's a lot to pull away because Ariane's weight at liftoff, 775 tons. She's burning now 5 tons of fuel per second. That's right, per second, 2.5 tons in each booster. And the core stage burning another 300 kilos per second. A tous les DDO, attention pour le décompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. 4, 3, 2, 1, top! Allumage Vulcan. Allumage 2 EAP. Décollage. Les à bord sont normaux, la trajectoire est nominale. Paramètres à bord sont normaux, la trajectoire est nominale. A picture's worth a thousand words. The rumble in the Amazon jungle that you're hearing right now is the Ariane 5 ECA as it uh, makes its way into uh, the sky over Corvu. Uh, again, it's my uh, fifth uh, Ariane 5 launch I've had the honor to do. Takes my breath away every time. And in just a moment, while well, we've just crossed the, uh, the speed of sound, and now the rumble comes. If you were here, you could feel this building shake as the Ariane 5 roars above us right now. It is one incredible. Look at that view on the camera as 1,300 tons of thrust Breaking the Ariane 5. Attention pour le décompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage Vulcan. Allumage des deux EAP et décollage. paramètres à bord sont normaux. Tous les paramètres à bord sont normaux, la propulsion est nominale. And we're off. Ariane 5 powering out into the night sky here at the Guyana Space Center. That streak of gold coming from those two powerful boosters. Just catching the sound of that now here, 15 kilometers from the pad as she flies over. And ATV Georges Lemaitre is on its way. Destination, our human outpost in space, the International Space Station. People in the viewing stations will have felt the ground shake. I've sent Charlotte out to go and watch the launch in uh, real life rather than on the screens here. So we'll wait to hear how she experienced it. Right now, the boosters are doing all the work. They're literally pushing us away from the Earth's gravity. That's what keeps us stuck to our planet. Makes it very difficult to leave as well. And we may get lucky and see those boosters falling away there with the naked eye.
Each one is burning two tons of propellant. That's an awful lot of propellant per second. Two tons per second. Just to give you an idea, if you filled your car once a week, that's just about the amount that you would be using in a year. Separation des étages d'accélération à poudre. And we did see them separating there. Superb sight, the boosters falling away. And this, ah, there we go, the two dots on either side and the white dot in the middle is the Vulcan engine that you can see. And those boosters falling back down. We're shedding weight. We don't need them anymore. We're losing each stage of the vehicle. Once it's burnt up its fuel, because, of course, the lighter we are, the faster we go. Right now, we've lost about three quarters of our weight in just over two minutes. So right now, the main stage is doing all the work, and you can see its Vulcan engine there. A tous des DDO. Attention pour les décomptes finales. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage Vulcan. Allumage EAP. Décollage. Paramètres à bord sont nominaux. Les paramètres à bord sont conformes à l'attendu. Eh bien, c'est comme d'habitude, c'est phénoménal, c'est époustouflant. As always, it's absolutely amazing. It's too quick and with a very uh, low cloud cover. But we are talking about 1,300 tons of thrust. That's the equivalent of 60 aircraft engines. And the two boosters are producing 90% of the power of the launcher. And the consumption rate is uh, close to two tons of propellant per second. In two minutes, 240 tons of uh, propellant will have been uh, consumed. Yes, you can hear the extraordinary noise levels being on the terrace here, we can truly feel the power through these uh, shock waves of sound. As you know that our cameras will simply not be able to track the launcher uh, for very long, so we'll have to uh, go back to the trajectory that you see on the screens. This reflects in real time the trajectory of Ariane uh, 5 because there's a little square that is moving along the predicted trajectory. À tous, Attention pour des comptes finales. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, unité, top, allumage moteur vulcain. Allumage confirmé. Top, allumage UAP, décollage. Lift off, c'est parti. Franchement, euh, à le cause du plafond qui est très bas, Henri, mais on l'entend passer. Ah oh oui, là, le, le, le son est vraiment euh, Vous l'entendez peut-être C'est important. Euh, on l'entend très, très fort. Oui, nous avons perdu le visuel. Il y a des cinq CA. Nous avons perdu le visuel, mais nous pouvons l'entendre. Quel thrust incroyable Ces deux powder. Ah, c'est incroyable. Et le ciel est the whole sky is vibrating. Yeah, even although the weather was not so good, we can really see the flames out of these EAPs and 
really a superb launch and it's really climbing and going up very high in the sky but we can still hear it very well whizzing past I don't know if you can hear it uh, as we can we were saying 540 tons of thrust each for the EAPs two tons of powder consumed per second that's 90% of the thrust which is given from the very beginning and these EAPs are going to be working a little bit more for a little bit more than two minutes so 240 tons of powder you can really hear them thundering across the sky Shh. <laughs>